What's up? What's up? What's up, everybody? I came on because I wanted to um, finish the box that I started yesterday. So hopefully, um, hopefully you guys can come on. Let me see if I can go ahead and send messages out. Hello, hello, hello. Let me see. If I can, oh, I just got a message, okay. Hi, how are you? Okay, so I'm going to finish the box that I started yesterday. I have, like, part of the box. Like, almost, almost a little under half. So I'm going to start there. And I'm just waiting for YouTube. Um, part two of box. Part two of Okay. I'm going to start with the kids jewelry because I didn't get a chance to um, do that yesterday. So I'm going to start and if somebody's interested then they can send me a message. So the kids jewelry is a dollar a piece and I sell five pieces for five. And this one comes in. Do you guys like my red, white, and blue? Look. Woo! So patriotic. I even had my eyes done too. Red, white, and blue, baby. I will show you all of the different ones. So these are bracelets and they're the slip knot bracelets, okay? So you just So there is a heart. Wait, if I can get it. There is a heart right there and this is a twine and it's a slip knot, okay? So this one is the pink and gray. This one is the yellow, pink and blue, okay? This one is the white uh, purple and blue with a little yellow. This one is yellow and orange. And this one is, um, has blue and a little bit of yellow right down here. Right here, there's a little bit of yellow right there. Okay. So there's five different colors, five for five dollars. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay. So you would get a set if you decide to order for the kids' jewelry. There's five different colors. They have little hearts on them right there. And they are, some of them are multicolor. Majority all, all multicolor and different colors. So five pieces for $5 on that. Uh, number on that one is going to be number 216. 216. Hello! I am so patriotic today. Look at that. Red, white, and blue, baby. Okay. I'm trying to finish the box I started yesterday. Um, so the video that I did yesterday was on YouTube, so you could find it there. Uh, if you see something you like there, just let me know. Take a snapshot picture of it. 
okay? Um, and then I'm doing the other half of the box, and I did get my Life of the Party pieces in there, but I had such bad luck last time where I had it in, you know, ready to order, and they all left, so I don't know if I want to go through the trouble again, but um, I'm going to try. Obviously, you, you know, you're not going to say forget it, but there are some really nice pieces in there, but it's hard to get... All right. I don't know. If, I don't think I showed this one yesterday. How's Teresa doing? I got your other stuff at the shop, Teresa. Whenever. That's pretty. Oh, look at that red button. Oh, I should have put that on today. Look at that. And remember, these colors are good for holidays. They're good for, you know, like 4th of July, Labor Day, Memorial Day, Ethnic Day, Voting Day, you name it. Uh, that one is uh, Jubilee and Jun uh, Jingle uh, 63. 63. This one here has the silver, um, almost like they stretched it out or whatever with the little um, silver balls. Silver balls! Silver balls! That one is number 247. Oh, wait. I'm picking the wrong ones. Am I picking the wrong ones? No. It looks like it. I'm doing good. Haven't made it back to Three Rivers yet. Ah, since Monday. This is cute. It's copper. Cute little flower design. Thicker back ring. Thank you. I'm trying to get a better color. There you go. That one is number 85. These are are white crackle stones. I like the little design going around there. Some lines, some squiggly, some tic-tac-toe lines. Cute. That one is number 81. For those of you that will come on later and see my video, if you see something you like, take a snapshot picture and email it to me or text it to me. So this one must have um I bet you this necklace here, which I'm keeping for myself. I, I think I had another one, but it matches that. It has the crystal beads, the clear crystal beads, the silver, and then it also has um rhinestones every so often. Right there. Right there, right there, and it is a um, slip knot design, but it's super cute. Number on that one is three fourteen. Three fourteen. It's like it's so close to that. Let's stick it right there. Oh, 
hello, hello, hello. Who's on? Hi, John. How are you? I just started, girl. Like, I only showed a few things. This one here is with the coconut. Um, exterior part of the coconut. And they have different colors. Pink, purple, yellow, orange, green, teal. Super stinking cute. I already have one of these. I love them. So this is like something that just came out recently in my new box. Love it. Look at that. That one is number 147. It's called uh, Wakiki Wins. Wakiki Wins. Number 147. Wakiki! Wakiki Wins. I've got some kids jewelry I'm going to show you too. I just showed you some some um, uh, bracelets. I'm going to show you some rings and earrings too. I'm doing good. I'm doing really good. I'm getting sick and tired of the political arena, the ups and downs, the ins and outs, and all the fighting that's going to go on. But that's okay. We will survive. We will have to change and implement some things. We will be fine. So this one here is um, a cuff, but it's like three. And it's got the little jagged lines going down the sides. Um, size on that, I mean, it looks really pretty. Um, it is kind of big on me, as you see. Hello, hello, hello. Who is on? Say hey for me. So it's going to fit, because I have a really dinky wrist, so... Um, I've been washing my hands so much, I've been, I've been like, scraping my knuckles. But, um, it will fit small, mediums, and it does give a little bit, but not too much. So you might be able to make it into the smaller, uh, largest. That one is number 23. Yeah, I know, I'm just getting tired of it. Time to move on. I've already done that. I keep, keep going downhill. This one here is is a rose gold and it's twisted on top. It is a cuff. It's quite large. So and it has a little bit of, of give to make it for the larger larges, okay? Um, this one is called Traditional Twist, Rose Gold, number 34. I got something. This looks really pretty. Wow, look at that. And that's all crackle stones. Blue crackle. Oh, look at that. Look how pretty that is. Blue crackle stones. And it comes with little buds there. Very pretty. I just hit myself on the knuckle. On uh, number 431. 431. Very pretty. Got these little oblong circles kind of filled in. I love this design up here. It's got little X's or something like that up here. It's pretty color. I mean, that's I mean it's silver, but these are considered larges. Okay, but they're I like them because they're busy. Not, normally they'll be just silver hoops, but I like it because it's got more silver. So it will show up even better. The 
remember that silver goes with anything that you're wearing on your neck. I mean, unless it's, you know, if you're wearing gold dress, I mean, then obviously you would have to put gold earrings in. But uh, this one is number 111, 111. Beautiful studs. Look at that. They're not studs. They're actually clip-ons. And if you look at the clip-on, you see that little uh, white tab there? If I open it up, there's another pad right there. That's the one that goes behind your ear. So it's not going to hurt you, okay, when it squeezes your ear. So that's why those, those little white things are in there. Super stinking cute. Nice, beautiful. And it's the size of that. Wow, look at that. They're going to see you coming. Very pretty. I like how um, the rhinestones that they have. I keep dropping things. The uh, rhinestones that, I, that, that they have are really clear. And they give you a really good color. You mean? So for these clip-ons, it's called Hold Court 79. 79. I stick them with my other ones. Give me one second. I gotta find what I've dropped. Okay. All right. It's such a tight place here. Oh my god, look at those. Oh my god, look at those. <gasps> These are extra large. But look. <gasps> so beautiful. The rhinestones going all the way around. And then they're silver pearls. But look, they're open on the back side for breathing because they're a large pearl. So it's like a large stone. Wow, oh, look at that. So elegant. So okay, number on that one is is called Incredibly Celebrity Celebrity uh, number four sixteen. Four sixteen. These are cute too. Love it. It's a purple crystal stones on the bottom. And they're considered a medium. Medium to large, but not really, really large because they're dainty up here. Large for me is when it's a bigger piece. This is longer. Yes, it's elongated, but it's also a shorter uh, eye catcher right there. So I'm going to say medium to large on that one. These would go, purples would go with yellow, blue, uh, green, gray, black, anything you wear. You can mix and mingle on that one. Number 180, 180. It's getting hot in here, but I'm also wearing one, two, and another one on the inside. I was going to take it off, but no, oh, I want to show them my my spirit today. Uh, it says, leave it to Lux. Leave it to Lux 184. So Lux means luxurious. Hey, baby. I made it. I'm here. That's right. You are here. I had four people, but all of a sudden they disappeared. Now it's just you. <laughs> oh, my lordy, lordy, lordy. Oh. Look at that. So it's hinged up here at the top a little bit. But these pieces here, 
the pieces that are on the bottoms here, going all the way up, is hematite stones, and the ones in the middle are clear rhinestones. So it's got, it's got that two color dimensional look to it. Do you see it? How this is lighter up here, darker down there. So it's gun or um, hematite stones here, and then clear rhinestones here. Super amazing. That's a beautiful piece, actually. Gorgeous! I said, leave it to Lux. 184. 184. Are you working, Cindy? Are you working, girl? I got to tell you a joke. You probably heard it. Some of you probably heard it. But I'm going to say a joke anyway. But why? Because it's my, my joke. That's right. I'm going to say it. Okay. Top pop. Beautiful. Top pop. Number 23. Number 23. So, there was this lady who worked in an office complex. But for her to go to work, she had to go through the little main town, you know, like the old-fashioned old town area there, to get there to be able to go. So she parked her car over here, she would walk through the little town, and she would go to where she had to go. And every day, when she started that job, she had to do that, right? So the first day she did it, she went by the little stores in the downtown area. And she um, was ready to hit a place that uh, sold pets, exotic pets and whatever. And so there was a cage outside and there was a, a bird, a parakeet, parakeet in there. So I told you the number is 23 on this one, right? Okay. So <clears throat> as she was going by, the bird said, hey, lady, hey, lady, because the bird talked. She goes, what? She says, the bird says, you ugly. She went, hmm, and she took off, and she went to work. Are you laughing yet, Sunday? So the next day, you know, she parks her car, going to work, passes by the um, pet shop, bird's outside. The bird says, hey, lady, hey, lady. She goes, what? You ugly. She took off, went to work. Next day, she came back. Same thing. She goes inside the shop. She goes, finds the owner. That bird is being abusive to me. Every time I walk through here, blah, blah, blah. It tells me, hey, lady, hey, lady. It tells me that I'm ugly. The man says, I'm so sorry. I am sorry. I will take care of it. Fine. She leaves. And the next day, so the bird got punished by the owner, right? So the next day, she comes by thinking she solved the problem, right? She was yipping at the owner about the situation, right? So the next day, she goes by. She's walking around, going to the thing, goes to the pet shop. The bird is outside in the cage, right? And the bird says, hey, lady, hey, lady. She goes, what? You know. <laughs> Cindy, I hope you like that one. <laughs> you probably already heard it, but I'm sure if you didn't, that was funny. <laughs> yep. Hey, lady! <laughs> You're hey, lady, right there. Hey, hey, lady! <laughs> it triggered and reminded me of that one. 
Okay. So these are so cute. They're antique looking. They're vintage looking, but they're not. And they've got the Papa Pink with the um, the uh, actually it's the hematite stones going all the way around. Do you see where it's kind of shiny going all the way around? That is the hematite stones, and then the 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 um, pink stones, and they're a medium. Look how cute they are! You can wear them with blue. You can wear them with yellow. But you can wear them with green. You can wear them with white. You can wear them with black. That's a cute color. And those are number 26. Twenty-six is your number. So this is copper. And it has little copper potato chip style because they're kind of bent. Um, they're not flat. And it's got the copper. But there's like two kinds of copper. One is more of a yellow. One's more of a pink copper. See it? See how this one's a little bit lighter? This one's a little bit darker, lighter, darker. So it is a two-tone. It does say it is copper, so I assume it is. But it is a two-tone copper. And then it comes with the same little earrings to match on top. Short necklace. <laughs> well, he, I'm sure he got punished, right? For saying you ugly, so. But, you know, you know. <laughs> he wasn't going to get his butt kicked again. Marge is too smart for that. He knew where his limit was. <laughs> but after telling her so many times, she knew. <laughs> he didn't have to say it. <laughs> okay, this one is a bracelet. I've had this bracelet before. They did come out with a white one too, but I don't remember if I have a white one. But this is the red one. It's 120. Number 120, it is a stretchy bracelet, number 120. The red is like a burgundy red, you know what I mean? It's a little different. Number 120 for that bracelet. And it fits a lot of different size hands, okay? Because it, it is um, expandable. It's probably a good thing my kennel dogs don't talk, huh? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> probably. <laughs> it probably is. Okay, earlier we saw these in the purple, and now these are in the green. So I've got purple and green crystal beads, okay? The green one is number... 191. 191. I know another one about a parrot, but it's not a good one. I mean, it's a good one, but it's only for me and you. <laughs> That's about it. It's a good Christmas one. It's got um, three chains and then it's got the ones with the uh, raspberry or, or uh, cranberry color round beads and then the silver ones. So it's very pretty. It's really cute for Christmas time, holidays and stuff. That one is number 135. It's called Fifth Avenue Romance. Fifth Avenue Romance. Earlier 
I showed you the same one. Uh, it's called this one is called Vintage Gardens. Uh, same design except for those were silver, and this one here has a teal color mixed in with it. This one is number uh, three twenty three. Isn't that pretty? Oh, look at that. And it, it makes it shimmer. The because you could see the silver and the look at that. That's beautiful. Wow. Pretty. Uh, that one's called Vintage Gardens number 323. It does have an extender and all that good stuff. And it comes with little silver bead earrings. Again, oh, uh, 323. So what happens if somebody doesn't want their bird? They can't bring it to the pound? <laughs> we had a really beautiful, uh, a beautiful bird that flew in, that flew in and then stayed for a year with an open cage and flew out a year later. The doors were always open at the shop, left and right. Never did he leave the cage. Oh, beautiful green bird. Um, I don't remember what it was exactly, what the name of it was. Um, it, was it flew in by mistake. Nikita grabbed it, stuck it on his hand, and then he had a cockatiel in the cage. I grabbed the cockatiel, <laughs> threw that son of a gun out, and put that one in. Because the cockatiel, all it was doing is going, yeah, 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 yeah. you know what I mean? <laughs> so he didn't like the bird in the first place, and he let it loose. And that one went to the cage, was on top of the cage, you know, for a year. And then one day, somebody opened the front door, which the front door, I was a lot of times in the summertime, we always left it open. And it flew right out. We never saw it, where it went or nothing. So it came and went. Number 110. Number 110. We've been stuck on Facebook just in case somebody lost it. Nobody claimed it. It's got the Infinity logo on here, guys. The Infinity logo right there. See it? Right there. Stretchy bracelets. It's, it's called Immeasurable Infinity 110. Number 110. look that's a threesome right there that's what I'm gonna call it three tier it's got a copper bead in all three tiers so when you oh look at that how pretty that is so remember that the upper one right here is a smaller neck size then it gets bigger then it gets bigger but you have to worry about making sure that you stick your neck in that first hoop okay it does have an extender. There is a two inch extender on there. So that will help. Look at that. So pretty. Sometimes you wonder, you look at something, you know, when you're ordering it and you're like, eh, you know, and then it really turns out to be really cute. Uh, number 130 for that one, 130 is called A Love for Luster. A Love for Luster 130. So I've seen this before, but in clear rhinestones, this one has hematite rhinestones. In the three circles, they're hematite. I don't know, you can see them very well, but they are hematite. 
And it is a lo lobster claw clasp design with a two inch extender on there. So, so it does have a little glisten to it because of the, um, the hematite stones. That one is called Dress the Part number 187. Dress the Part number 187. Uh, these are four bracelets. One is gunmetal, one is silver, and then there's two that are the teal bluish color with the silver beads. They're not really teal. They're actual blue, but like a denim blue. So you got one gunmetal here, a silver one here, and then the two mixed ones. Four stretchy bracelets. Uh, number uh, 66. Number 66. Oh, so these are crackle stone as well. Crackle blue stones, and it's got a little silver bead in every other one, very dainty. So if you like crackles blue stones, but you don't want a big piece, this would be the piece for you. Still have crackle, and voila. Very, very elegant and beautiful, and yes, it's gonna be closer up here. 66, please. You got it, girl. I won't bring it to the shop because you don't get paid till. So I'm just gonna leave it here, put it in a bag and put your name on it and then I'll bring it to the shop in a couple days. So this one here is called uh, extinct species number 310. Extinct species number 310. Uh, tour de tri Trendsetter. Tour de Trendsetter number 314. It is a pink and gold necklace. Oh, look at that. And you know what? Um, it's got crystal beads. Um, so, okay, hang on. Let me fix it to show it to you. Let me put it on this thing. Stupid bag. Hang on, I'm still twisting them around. Gotta make it look beautiful. Okay, here we go. You see, it's got the teardrop crystal see-through beads. The larger solid, the smaller solid. It is on gold chain. And it's got, I love these little things. You know what they remind me of? Pomegranate seeds. Which, which, I think I have a couple in the refrigerator that I'm going to have. Isn't that cute? Very elegant. And it does have the little pink beads for earrings as well. Uh, Tour de tr Trendsetter number 314. 314. 
I also have a stretchy bracelet that is the same thing as that one exactly. The same bracelet as the blue one, a Cindy, but it comes in black. So still got the gunmetal, the silver, and then instead of blue beads like the one that you just picked, it has the black beads. Exact same one as the blue one. This number here is number 105. Number 105. The other one was the 66. Look how sexy those are. Woohoo! Can you imagine get, going to work with these, girl? I would wear them. It's got the uh, clear rhinestones up here in the squares, and then it's got the chain links as tassels. Which I love really way better than regular tassels. Uh, number 166. It's called... Radio Waves 166. Okay, I want that one too, please. The bracelet. Yep, it's exactly the same as the one set. Except one is blue, one is black. Same design. I got you, girl. And the earrings, the long earrings, those are 166. Here's one that I like. Um, this could be for a man or a woman. It's an urban. It's called Tuned In. It's considered a silver, which I think is kind of not right, but um, it's number 156. And it has the moonstones, which have the crevices. Uh, Yep, you're welcome. The moonstones with the crevices so that you can put the essential oils in there. It's got the silver spacer, and then these are like uh, marbled moonstones, I guess I'd call them, or, you know, they're rocks. They're stones. So, yeah, there's this would go in the front. These would go in the back. These would go in the side, the little spacers. It's made for men and for women. As soon as my son sees it, he'll probably take it away. I had one something similar and he took it. Uh, 156. 156. It is a larger, so it's good for larger wrists, okay? Oh my God! Okay, how am I going to show that? Okay, so this design we've seen before with the pink rhinestones in there, but this here is green. Do you see the emerald green? Man, how do I do that? Right there. See the emerald green? See them? Right there. Those are emerald green ones. Oh, do you? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think I'm the one who sold it to you, and then my my son grabbed one too. But I didn't think it looked like that. I thought it was a little different. Super cute. Green emerald in the middle. If I can get it to work again. Right there. Boom. Um, and they're post earrings. Beautiful. Number on that one is um, number six. 62. It's called Country Court. Court. Oh my gosh, I can't. Country Courtliness? <laughs> I don't know. Country Courtlands. What is it called? 
62. So I've got this bracelet in a pink um, rhinestone, in a blue aqua rhinestone, and I don't know what color that is, so let me see. It's called Extra Size of Elegance, number 123, 123. Okay, so it's a black diamond rhinestone in the middle. So it's a black diamond rhinestone in the middle, and then on the sides are also black diamond rhinestones. So I've got one that has pink, and white rhinestones and blue and white rhinestones. And this one is a black rhinestone with um, black diamond rhinestones going all the way around. And it is a thicker band, um, but it's really comfortable on me. And I don't like thin band ones, so it works out pretty good. I've got big fingers. Again, number 123 on that one. Oh, the honeycomb. This one here, this one here came out as, as, um, as an exclusive piece. But it was a different color. It was a honey color. This one here is towards the greener color. So it is a brass uh, necklace, and look at that! Those are all cat eyes, green cat eyes. Green cat eyes. So beautiful. Look at that. Beautiful. Number on that one is 188. It's called East Coast Elixir. East Coast Elixir. Beautiful. Number 188. 188. Very cute. They are the um, clear rhinestones going all the way around with the black onyx stones. There's holes in the back of them for breathing, so those are stones. Number on that one is number 278, the Modern Monroe. The Modern Monroe. Number 278. 